Hello fam and welcome back to another video. This is our monthly family Costco grocery haul for this month and I can't wait to show you what we got. I was trying to stick to a really strict budget as you know. We also do our monthly meal plan with weekly revisions and we also inventory, check our fridge, pantry and freezer, make sure we're using up everything that we have so nothing goes to waste. And if you do want to stick to a budget, make sure you go into Costco with a list. That's a great way to save money. Get a lot of questions about the coupon book. You do not have to clip coupons, okay? You just go in there and when you check out, it comes off. Always double check your receipt and make sure, but yes, it's automatic. By the way, if you go between coupon books, always double check. They do have some random sales and it's really fun to look for those. Be careful, stay on budget, right? But just, it's fun to look. <laughs> And we are just getting back from Costco, and this is our November 2023 Costco haul. We spent just around $150, and I can't wait to share with you some things we got. Some tried and trues, and some new things. Some things are on sale, too. There's a couple of sale items in here. Definitely check out that Costco coupon book video for November, so you can take advantage of all the deals during that time frame. I did get some Starbucks coffee, and here's the thing about Starbucks. Now... I got this Starbucks with my Fetch Rewards. If you guys aren't using Fetch, it's basically an app where you scan receipts and you earn rewards. And I basically cash out my rewards for gift cards. And as you can see, I don't normally get Starbucks, but I, I normally get Dunkin' Donuts. But I don't really like the reward system lately. I don't know. Let me know what you guys prefer. Dunkin' Donuts or Starbucks. It's really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Delicious. All right. First and foremost, we have our rotisserie chicken. $4.99 and a ton of meals. I'm going to have some tonight, share it out for the family with some salad, and we're just gonna have that kind of, with a little bit of maybe some minute rice I have in the pantry. Easy meal, but then I'm gonna use some of this for fajitas tomorrow, and then I'm gonna use the rest of it for a chicken soup, a nice big stew, and you could also make bone broth if you'd like with the bones and the skin, it makes a lot of really good bone broth. This was actually something that I've been wanting to try for a long time, but it was just an unexpected sale. It's a two pound value pack. Look at this, huge of this Hormel pepperoni. I know it's a lot of pepperoni, okay? But you can freeze pepperoni. Another good thing is that it was $2.50 off, bringing it down to like $6.49, which I think is a really good deal. I'm thinking for, I make like little pizza pockets with the kids with low carb tortillas and a little bit of sauce. I use these for just snacking with cheese. We make like charcuterie boards. I know it's pepperoni, not salami, but it could go on a charcuterie board. Also, I like to make homemade pizzas, so that's really good. Just use some, if you're doing the low carb tortillas or flour, a little bit of sauce and cheese and you're good to go. The Borzen is on sale. I love this stuff. It always goes on sale this time of year around the holidays. It was $2.50 off, I believe, and so it brought it down to about $6 and change. You get the garlic and fine herb two pack, and then the shell and chive. My kids love this with crackers. <laughs> One of my kids loves it just to eat on its own. I know, it's so good. It almost is like a really creamy cream cheese. You can also use it to cook with, put it on top of some ch chicken breast, put it in some ground beef, and you're, you can make a nice, really creamy, delicious meal. It's already seasoned, so it's so delicious. This went down, for, well, this used to be $9.99, the six pack of chicken breast. It went up to $14.99, now it's back to $12.99. I still use this though for lunches, for the kids, for the school. I also use it for my broccoli cheddar chicken soup, which is literally just cream cheese, chicken stock, broccoli, onion, garlic, sauteed with butter, and then I throw this and some cheddar cheese in. So delicious and so easy. The Kirkland grass fried butter is back in stock, woo! It was actually out of stock for a while, and this is just like the Kerrygold. So it's a great Kerrygold dupe. If you're looking for the Kerrygold grass fed butter, once you go grass fed, honestly, I, you can't go back. Well, I can't go back. And this is now, I think three or four dollars cheaper than Kerrygold. It's nine ninety nine for this pack. Really good. Um, this I've been obsessed with. I've been getting this got a couple times, and I love making these. These are a little bit more than one pound each. I will do exactly like that. Stuffed peppers with frozen cauliflower rice, which I have in my freezer, and I just kind of make the so delicious. I make everything. Um, stuffed peppers, I make meatloaf, I make turkey meatballs. I'll just do like a little bit of a stir fry. I love this because it kind of offsets the ground beef, which by the way, these are the two main meats I love to get from Costco. I do still get Butcher Box. You can check that out in the link below, but I do love to get these because they just taste really good. The ground beef is amazing. It's gone up in price by about 20 cents a pound. It's now, I think, 4.19 a pound. I split this into either four to five packs, just under about, 
I'd say right under a pound and I use my scale, but still I haven't found, it's 88% lean, 12% fat. I just haven't found one that tastes better. They were giving this out as a sample. They didn't need to, cause I already love it. If you're low carb, this is really great. It's very low carb. Let me show you the, uh, it's really small people. Oh my gosh. It, I, I'll just tell you, you probably won't be able to see it. Ooh. Oh my gosh. What is it? <laughs> two carbs for two tablespoons. So one, one carb per tablespoon. And I love this with celery sticks. Now, obviously, because I'm low carb, you could do that. But if you like crackers, you could put this on top of chicken breast. It's so delicious. You can cook with it. You can have it as a dip. Everyone in the family loves it. So we got it for some crackers, which I'm going to share with you are on sale. Actually, let me just go over there right now. The Ritz crackers, guys. My family and I don't get these, but because they were on sale, 18 stacks for $6 and change, I couldn't, I just couldn't. I'm thinking charcuterie boards and holidays, they're all coming up. Ritz is just a classic cracker that a lot of people love. So we're gonna be doing all kinds of different things. I'm gonna be using with pepperoni, with some boards and cheese, with the hatch chili dip. We're also gonna be doing peanut butter and crackers for the school, for the kids' lunches. My kids like to switch it up sometimes for lunch. Rather than either having a chicken sandwich or a peanut butter sandwich, we'll do that. So we have peanut butter in the pantry and we're good to go. So really good deal on this. These are also on sale, guys. If you're looking for something like this, um, they are on sale right now, $3.50 off. So they were $10.99 with $3.50 off. Really good deal. And I love these for breakfast, easy breakfast, with like a little hard-boiled egg if you're on the go. I will pre-batch cook some hard-boiled eggs, and then we'll just kind of put these in the air fryer, and the kids can do it on their own. It's really easy, really simple, and it's a nice protein-packed breakfast. I don't always get these, by the way. I would not get probably the uh, most of the sale items I would not get if they weren't on sale, but they're on sale. Oh, speaking of on sale, look at this. The real good lightly breaded chicken strips Okay, 450 off. So they were about 14 and change. So it, it brought it down to right about $10. It is huge, it's three pounds. And I'm telling you, people were fighting over these. <laughs> As I was getting them, people were waiting to get them out of the cupboard. And even the cashier was like, these are really good. Air fry them though, air fry them. I will say they don't have the most, I expected them to be highly seasoned, they're not. So what you're gonna wanna do is like, I put them on these low carb tortilla wraps, by the way got these really really great with some cilantro and some red onion and jalapenos oh, a little bit of mayonnaise oh, so good you could also put them in like a pasta sauce I mean there's so much you could do with these you tell me your your ideas in the comments below but I just love them because they are breaded and they are low carb okay so they have a breading on them but they're not they're not that breading that is um, like a Kentucky Fried Chicken, but it's just the right kind of breading to give you a little bit of something other than just a rotisserie chicken strip. So really happy about those. Definitely grab those, stock up on them if you want them. People were going nuts over them. $3.99 for baby spinach. We do prefer the mixed greens. We just aren't seeing them right now. We're not seeing these, but still really good. Four bucks for this. This has gone up to almost $9. I'm so sad. It used to be $6.99. I'm still going to grab it, though. You get four. Now, if I wasn't a Costco member, I would just get broccoli florets somewhere else. But they do come in these big one-pound packages, and they serve us for, usually for two meals. So one big pound, because they're huge florets. I either use one for like a broccoli cheddar chicken soup, a casserole, a stir-fry, and usually that meal will last us at least more than one meal, sometimes you know, three nights or whatnot. So really great deal on these. And last but not least, of course, eggs. You gotta get eggs. Got my eggs. They came to about $1.79 a dozen. Let me know what the price of eggs are at your Costco. I see them going down. This was about $8.79. So I was really happy about that. And that's what we got. We got a couple of sale items. I wanted to share with you some new items we got. I'm excited about some of the deals going on this month. Check out our Costco coupon book video so you can get in on some of those. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And we'll see you in the next one. I wanted to share with you a quick Chalk Zero purchase that I just made, so a little Chalk Zero haul for you. I do have a discount code, and I, I absolutely love that I can share that with you guys. I've been eating this for about five years. I don't get a discount, but if you guys purchase, you get a discount and I get a little bit of a kickback, and I do appreciate that, but you don't have to. I just want to share this because I'm obsessed with Chalk Zero. So they do have out these new pecan patties or turtles or whatever you want to call them. They're so delicious. They have that caramel and pecan, almost like a Snickers bar. They also came out with their little donkeys, which are like their Oreos, their little sandwich cookies. They taste amazing. And then I also got 
their vanilla syrup, which is sugar-free, obviously, sweetened with monk fruit, and I've been using it in my coffee for the fall. It's amazing. I love it. I love it. I love it. I did get chocolate milk, milk chocolate orange, 50% cocoa, dark chocolate squares, and then I got two jams and the new Rhea, Rhea, Rhea candy bars. <laughs> I love this stuff. Okay, so the orange chocolate tastes, literally tastes like those little orange chocolate candies I used to have growing up. My dad used to get them for us. And then the, I also love the fact that they have the marmalade. I dip the dark chocolate in the marmalade. Oh, so good. If you are low carb or keto, the marmalade and the jelly, the strawberry jelly tastes just like the regular. So you can make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich like you used to. And then these Rhea bars. Oh my gosh, they're so good guys. Oh my gosh. By the time you're watching this video, these are already gone. <laughs> I don't even know if they're in stock. I got them as soon as they dropped them. They taste like Snickers. I'm not even kidding. They're gluten-free, keto, free. they're keto and they're soy-free. They have caramel, peanuts, and nougat. And even my kids say they taste a lot like Snickers because the nougat and the caramel is on point. Plus with those peanuts, so delicious. So if you do want to grab this, go ahead and use the discount code free to family at, at checkout and it'll save you. But again, I use my own money to buy this. Hands down, one of my absolute favorite chocolates and I don't pretty much eat anything else. It's low carb. It's keto, it's sugar-free, and they use monk fruit. So definitely go ahead, use the link below or the code free to family at checkout to save. And don't forget to take advantage of these offers and great ways to earn more money. With Rakuten, you can get an additional $30 bonus when you sign up and spend $30 or more using the referral link in the video description. You can also receive up to 20% cash back every time you shop at your favorite stores. Just use the app or the Chrome extension. Next, we have the Ibotta app where you can get cash back when doing your grocery shopping. You can also receive a $10 bonus when you sign up and upload your first receipt using the referral code on the screen or the referral link in the description box below. And in case you want to maximize your rewards, you can use a second app like Fetch Rewards to upload the same receipt you just used from